There it is. Okay. There it is. <laughs> I can feel the excitement just not from me, but from everyone else in the world too. It all feels like it's coming up together. I love how they just announced these out of nowhere. Who are we going to see first? Koizumi? No. What? It's Fire Emblem. It's Fire Emblem. Three hopes. Oh, it's based on three houses. I'm guessing. The cycle of this world. I will not allow it to perish with you. Because they're playing the the main theme. I seek to destroy the That's cool. I like the idea. I like it a lot. If the kingdom is ever to part ways with like, our bloody past. And it just makes perfect sense, right? This, this makes perfect sense. There's our boy Dimitri. There's the most handsome boy, Claude. Like, this is something that's just a natural progression. It makes sense. It's not even milking a series, it's just like this this is gonna be a great companion game to three houses. Goth boy. You know? This is just a perfect companion. We shall fight, we shall survive, and we shall win a glorious future for Fodlan. A ponytail. Now that I know, I won't make the same mistake again. It's gonna be interesting to fight with them, like, cause I think it was cause these characters I I personally spend so much time with them. I think it's gonna be interesting for me to fight with them. Not a sin you take for someone else. So manually. You seek revenge to slake your rage and heal your wounded heart. I know you are prepared to do whatever that you must. June 24th! They had it ready. Hello, everyone. I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll I'm gonna be turn up. I'm watching on a slight delay just so there's no hiccups. As you can see, on a slight delay. What you just saw was the trailer for the Fire Emblem Warriors Three Hopes game. Okay. We hope you'll look forward to a different story set in the same universe as Fire Emblem Three Houses. I really like the idea. Let's see the first batch of Nintendo Switch headlines. <laughs> you know there might be some stuff in this because you. We've got more intel on the Advance Wars 1 plus 2 reboot. Because they're going right into the headlines. In the first campaign, Advance Wars, you'll advise a colorful cast of I've actually wanted to see more of this game. Use their abilities in vibrant because like I wasn't battles. totally sold in the art Each style, but I'm totally sold in the idea of the game. Voiced. Bringing even more charm to these characters. You're gonna get hurt. I see right through your plans. Another full campaign awaits in advance. But again, I don't want to judge a game Black just like based off some stuff I've seen, you know, so far. I want to more diverse terrain can be leveraged see as much as I can. Tactical opportunities. Like blasting through pipelines to cross into enemy territory. In both oh, this actually looks kind of good. You can fast forward gameplay and reset your turns for a smoother I think it's just because I, I've never played the original game myself as well, so. Outside of both campaigns with I'm just kind of super excited to see. Go for high scores in the war room. What this feels Create like to play. Share custom maps in the design Character room. designs are really good too. Or battle friends and frenemies in local and online multiplayer. Advance Wars 1 plus 2 Reboot Camp April 8th. onto the Nintendo Switch system April 8th. Pre so many games coming out. Now on Nintendo e so many games. What's next? Explore an infinite universe. What is In this? In No Man's Sky, every star oh. is the light oh. of a distant sun. Each orbited by planets teeming with life. Travel they really turned this game around, though. In this infinite, At least that's what I've heard universe. from people who play the game now. Here, you'll discover extraordinary lands and creatures that have never been seen before and may never be seen again. And it's proof that, like, making you must a big faux pas... I don't want to even say it's a mistake because it was a dedicated kind of thing, but... Um, in this you can overcome it. Breathing universe. If you work hard, and you work hard to, like, stars, prove yourself to your fan base. Vie for territory. And this is what that Pirates series did. Hello Games did that. And the authorities are ever watchful. I have headphones on, by the way, so I can hear your journey may be <laughs> what they're saying. Danger. And actions have consequences. Traitor. Fighter. Explorer. How will you live in this universe? Like, I kind of think of this, like, in the cyberpunk context as well. It's like, if they worked really hard and showed that they're working, like...
What's this? Is this a football game? Is this a football game? It's... I'm saying this right now with 100% with honesty. This is one of the last things I would have ever guessed. Even though it makes perfect sense. Right? Like, this makes perfect sense. And this is coming out early this year. I kind of like how Nintendo's just totally focused on making a bunch of games for the system, no matter what they are. Mario Strikers Battle League. Strikers, okay. For strike, a five -on -five Was there a Strikers game, a Mario Strikers game before? Aim for goals I'll play this. I think I might play this. <laughs> as well as by using tackles. <laughs> All Luigi in like a I uniform. Peach in a football shots. uniform, this is so cool. The main rule in this sport is to rule the field. Try to score Peach more is unusually tall. <laughs> there are two Peach looks unusually tall. Help you with your strategies. First, the gear you equip. Yeah, it changes not only your appearance, but also your stats like speed, strength, and pass accuracy. Mm -hmm. Customize as you see fit. Second, the hyper strike. To activate this shot, grab an orb when it appears on the field. And like, I'm, I'll, I'll 100% admit that, like, distracted. I'm not super excited about this, but I'm excited about the idea of, like, maybe Hit playing with friends as well. You'll score not one, but two goals. Like, for me, these guy games would be great with, like, a story mode, you know? Up to eight players, four players but that's not really what they're for, I suppose. So I'm just kind of, like, Nintendo Switch putting expectations on something that didn't ask to have expectations on it, you know? Matches, or showed no reason to have, have expectations. Which is unfair, so I'm not going to do that. In -game club and compete for placement in the rankings. Up to 20 players can join <laughs> to Oh my so god, look at Wario. And invite friends and family to play alongside you. Or join an existing one owned by other players. Try to become the world's top club. With items. Yeah, the items are what's going to be, I think, fun. What, like, the, what's our Mario Strikers, Strikers before? Anything goes on this field. Or is that Persona 5 Strikers? Mario Strikers Battle League launches June 10th? on Nintendo Switch. June That's a nice 10th. June game. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo That's during summer, exa like summer exams for... The latest iteration of the Mario Strikers series is coming to Nintendo Switch. For sure. We hope you're excited for this Anything Goes Battle Soccer game. Next, please take a look at this. We're only like eight minutes into this, not even. What is this? It's a platinum game. <laughs> I don't know, I just saw the... Wait. No, it's, it's Splatoon. <laughs> Still though, like, like I wanted to get into Splatoon for a while though. Like, I think it is a fantastic art style. My nephew's crazy into it. Like, I think going through the story mode on the channel would actually be really fun for some of these games. Yeah, just terrific. Like, how to make your art stuff. Like, Nintendo knows how to do this very well, and Nintendo Studios know how to do this very well. Making the art style of, like, a new game iconic within, like, five minutes. And Splatoon was that. Like, these characters are iconic looking now, you know? Nintendo's very good at that. They're very good at doing that when they want to. Create a new franchise. Music's very unusual, but like, I don't know if this is the music that you usually have in Splatoon. Like, it's not bad, but it's just very unusual. Egg throw? Oh, you get him with the egg throw. Like, as well, creating a game that can, like, be super competitive 
like also me not making it look like it's just like depressing is <laughs> so it's like, such a good idea. Like this looks pretty without being depressing. Salmon Run Next Wave? Is that the name of the game? Is that the name? Is like a DLC? That was the trailer for the co-op mode in the Splatoon 3 game. The next wave of Salmon Run. Okay. The giant salmonid, one that's never been seen before, was also spotted at the end of the trailer. Will the Inklings and Octolings ink or swim? Splatoon 3 will launch this summer. Yeah, I was thinking it didn't launch yet. Great logo too. Great letters, like great font. Let's move on to more Nintendo Switch headlines. Oh, yeah, let's go. <laughs> Fonzers at the ready. Fonzers? Oh. This is a platinum game. I figure if I call everything a platinum game, Reggie, I'm gonna get it right. Um. Here's something you don't usually hear me say. Of the first front mission game is storming onto Nintendo Switch. I'm out. <laughs> I'm not a fan of mechs RPG, or Gundams for me personally. Called and lead your battalion to victory. It's just I never really dig the design. I know some people are gonna be like, that's that's, well, the 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 world. that's cool. I'm not like insulting like people's opinion on them. Parts to destroy. I just I'm not fond of them. They don't look cool to me. Mix and match various weapons and parts to cut. Like this doesn't look cool to me for like I I get the appeal. Oh, I get to peel these character designs though. Uncover the great Yes, oh my god, Karen. Hi. When Front Mission 1 Remake launches on Nintendo Switch this summer. I get the the character and designs look pretty really good. The sequel, Front Mission 2 Remake, will also launch on You should have announced that you should have announced that in the next direct. That would that would have been big for, for for those fans. Get set for a high octane Disney and Pixar combat racer. What? From the creators of the Asphalt series comes rip roaring racing action across Disney, Disney Speed and Pixar Storm. inspired race tracks. Race as a legendary You know what? We need more racing games. Is that Jack Sparrow? Circuits, using each one special We need more cartoony fun racing games. The finish line. Choose Mickey Mouse for symphonic speed. Like it's very Some clear that we're not going to get Crash Team Racing anytime or soon or Crash Team Racing 2 anytime soon anytime soon. Each racer also possesses powerful ultimate skills. Perfect for turning the tables at the last second. Disney Speedstorm is a free-to-play game with new what? seasons added regularly, bringing more exciting Disney. Oh, and Pixar okay. So I'm guessing, like, circuits, carts, if it's in seasons, more. it's probably gonna be like Plus, Fortnite, where you can like platform play as well as split-screen and online multiplayer modes. Cross-platform. Speedstorm races onto Nintendo Switch. This See, this is coming. Cross-platform makes it seem like it's gonna be on PC and PS4 and Xbox as well. Dive into these classic franchises on Nintendo Switch. Huh? Unleash the power of the Force in this classic Star Wars Whoa. action adventure. As Darth Vader's like, here's the princess, thing. These games, these games were interesting. I like it. Force powers and I didn't expect this. As you hunt down Jedi masters on iconic planets, upgrade abilities like Force Grip and Force Repulse. Yep, did not expect this. Combine them for even more destructive combos. Use button controls or opt for motion controls. These were like some of the most talked about games on the playground, though, when they were announced and like in, in the sequel yard. This was like the thing, who is you know? The galaxy's most powerful Jedi. Star Wars The Force Unleashed launches on Nintendo Switch April 20th. Pre orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. How much, though? The complete saga of legendary assassin oh. Ezio Auditore da Frenze Never played Assassin's Creed. Three critically acclaimed Assassin's Creed games. Explore Renaissance Italy and 16th century Constantinople. Interact with historical figures and discover secrets of the creed across three games, two bonus short films, and DLC. That looks plus take advantage Again, I'm not of the features for the Nintendo Switch. I hate being that go. guy who's like on a stream going, that looks free controls. Cause like I'm not gonna and optimized on You don't display. know until like digital foundry get its hands on it, you know? Collection. Launches on Nintendo Switch Cause it could be the video, Switch. it could be anything. Pilot mobile suits in dynamic action RPG battles. Strange incidents called breaks are occurring across the Gundam universe. Find out what's causing them and restore the proper timeline. You'll lead three mobile suits in battle. Enhance each suit with parts to improve their power. You can also battle alongside friends in online co-op multiplayer. SD Gundam Battle Alliance launches on Nintendo Switch this year. 
two worlds cross in the triumphant return of this RPG classic. Huh? A remaster <gasps> of the acclaimed RPG Chrono Cross is what? coming to the Nintendo Switch system. When? Well, it's coming early. Yes. The protagonist Surge wanders into an alternate That's world. That's such a good idea. So it somewhat resembles his home. That's world, such a good idea. I might no actually let's play this. Here. I've never played How these games. I've always happen? wanted to. What I was going to buy them. Another world. Travel back and forth between both worlds to unravel the story. Would you guys be interested Over in a let's play? Oh, can this can join your yeah, party. it's a really depending on the choices cool. you make, the allies who accompany you, and the endings that I might actually differ. let's play this. <laughs> I think it's gonna be fun. Have been made to this remaster. Like what? Like the ability to turn off enemy encounters and a new that is... enhanced soundtrack. Plus, Radical Dreamers, originally released on the Satella View, is included. Experience What's Radical Dreamers? Of Chrono Cross in this text-based adventure. Okay, it's a text-based game. Chrono Cross, the Radical Dreamers edition, dashes and That's slashes so close. its way onto Nintendo Switch April 7th. Pre-orders begin today. I'm pre-ordering today. Shop. I'm pre-ordering today. Oh, this is what I wanted to see. I wanted to be sold on this game, on this Kirby game. I want because I want I want to let's play this too. My name's Burby. That's Kirby's mortal enemy, Burby. So this is not in-game, right? This is a cutscene or a well. They didn't say that they. Or I, I didn't catch it. They did say. Are we gonna become a furry Kirby? What's your persona? What's your persona, Kirby? Oh, he's gonna become a car. That looks like it hurts. Wait, he's gonna become a car? Wait, what? Or he just... Okay. This looks very improved from the first time we saw it. Unforgettable 3D platforming adventure. Kirby and the Forgotten Land. It all takes place in a mysterious world. I'm kind of glad that it's not like big open world as I thought it was going to be. This looks like it's just going to be kidnapped Waddle Dee's Kirby sets overworld. Off on a new adventure. Yeah, I'm sold. This looks great. It looks way better than we originally saw it in. Introducing mouthful mode. What? <laughs> Introducing what? Car mouth? Hello, mother. I'm just playing car mouth. Juice cans. This makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> cone mouth. Cone. But the visuals are totally selling me, and like I like the idea that yeah, it's not going to be this gigantic open mouth, world. Because I feel like fatigue would set in very Kirby, quick. Depending on the object he inhales. Some games just don't need to be big open worlds. Enjoy exploring with. I like light bulb mode. That's very cool. From copy abilities. So what's Kirby, the lore behind this? This looks pretty really good. Like this looks this. super good. Kirby rescues Waddle Dee's. Waddle Dee Town will continue to grow. Oh and my god, town building! Will become available. Town building! Yeah, this is great. This looks great. At Waddle Dee's weapon shop, familiar copy abilities can be evolved. Evolve copy abilities to expand Kirby's range of attacks. Like, the thing is, like, they, they sold me, like, 30 seconds ago. <laughs> Bore. But I just think that, like, we judged the visuals maybe too harshly the first time we saw it. I didn't, but, like, I think, you know? Because I think this actually looks good for what it is. A cartoony platformer. A new adventure awaits our pink puffball. Mm-hmm. Who are the beast pack? What are these enemies trying to do? Can Kirby restore peace to this world? Kirby and the Forgotten Land launches on the Nintendo Switch system March 25th. Pre-orders are available so now close. on Nintendo eShop. That's so close. I was expecting to play Pokemon that next, but we Kirby might not be. And the Forgotten Land, launching later next month. Please look forward to its release. Let's take a look at some more Nintendo Switch headlines. This is already I like I've actually enjoyed this direct so far. This has been really nice. We still have 20 minutes left or so. Hi. Hi. Yes. Yes. Okay. Wasn't this? It used to be a Sony exclusive. 
but that's not all. You can even play and now it's like multi-platform because they 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 asked for it to with be. I think. Progression, you can also earn and use content on any platform where MLB The Show 22 is available. Yeah. Because it was Sony exclusive, I think. With you on Nintendo Switch. And MLB was like, well, you're gonna lose the rights to make MLB the game. The show 22 online matches on other consoles. Ooh, that's a very no image. But we gotta expect this, guys. Like, you can invite them and play online. You make slight compromises on the Switch. Oh, that's a good. That's a nice cover. I knew you were a true two-way player, but this Who is, is this? ridiculous. Who is this? Sheesh. Hit him. You're gonna have your hands full of games with these collections. Game collection? Three Kingdom Hearts collections are almost here. Oh. Kingdom Hearts. I have Kingdom these. Hearts I own all these games. I haven't played the them all, but I own them. DLC. Every entry is coming to Nintendo I'm Switch. I own them on the PlayStation. That can be played while connected to the internet. I, d I, live or get to know these adventures I still can't get into cloud versions of games for me personally. Like, these are cool looking and games and I can't wait to eventually time. play them. TV, but I just like... It's not Hearts happening with me. Masterpiece for cloud. Containing all three game collections. Soars onto Nintendo Switch tomorrow. Soars onto... Each collection's onto. cloud version will also be individually available on Nintendo eShop. Kelowna? We what? Nintendo Switch. Kelowna? Across dreamy side scrolling levels. You'll run, jump, and hover while firing wind. This has been like actually a pretty enemies. good direct. Use each level pretty great direct. To your advantage. Also, Klonoa 2 is included. Take on these great adventures when Klonoa. Like if you had the switch, like I'm sorry, I'm sorry, for me, if I only had the switch, I'm eating for the first like like with all these games. We're so glad you're here. Oh no. Come oh here no. Either One of the way, most suggested games of my channel ever. <laughs> in these award-winning games, the oh, no. gun is your key to survive here we go. imprisonment in a mysterious lab. Create I'm saying oh no because to other areas to find I'm going to get it like the, the suggested like still unconfirmed. 50 you times a day, right? Portals. Now, <laughs> cubes, lasers, and robots with unnerving levels of personality. The sequel adds in local, online, and split screen. I really like how they're doing collections because they don't need to. Nintendo no doesn't lie. need to do this. Neither is the sentient robot monitoring your every move when Portal Companion Collection warps onto Nintendo a good Switch name. this year. It was a good name. A classic comes alive. What is. Okay, that's a mountain range. Is this another 2.D remake? Is this... Live Alive. <gasps> That's super pretty. Oh my... This direct's really good. <laughs> I'm gonna play the shit out of this. Unreleased outside of Japan, the RPG Live Alive so, okay, this is cool. I've never heard of this. I'll be honest. I've never heard of this. Multiple stories featuring different protagonists and time periods. Oh my god, cowboys? You tackle them is up to you. Prehistory. A tribesman comes of age in a world without words. This looks amazing. The Wild West. A wanderer with a bounty on his head. I just got chills. <laughs> Imperial China. A kung fu master searches for a worthy successor. Twilight of Edo, Japan. A shinobi undertakes an this looks so cool. <laughs> this looks like goody material. Martial artist strives to become the strongest there ever was. The near future, a youth with psychic powers takes a stand against evil. I'm into the near future the stuff as well. Future, a newly built robot Put me on a bike. A Put me on a bike. Space. What other stories are on the horizon? When? When is this coming out? My loyalty in death. There's voice acting too, which is great. Live Alive launches on Nintendo Good Switch date. July 22nd. Good date. I will be off work. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. How was that? Next up is this. Next up is... Oh, it's it's a... It's a... Sports it's game? A Whoa! Someone predicted this on Twitter. A random sports. user. <laughs> I saw in the replies. Here are the sports included in the Nintendo Very Switch cool. sports game. 
You might recognize these three from past Wii Sports games. Can I be honest, though? This would have, like, sold, like... It's probably gonna sell really well, but this would have sold, like, bazillions. This would have sold the Switch for, like, families as well. Like, for sure. I think it will as well. Like, this is, like, the type of thing you get for, like, families and stuff as well. Because me and my sister used to play Wii Sports all the time in Wii Sports Resort. Don't hate this boy. He's got a cool haircut. Plus, three additional sports are joining the lineup. Soccer. Use a gigantic ball to make dynamic plays. Enjoy matches with Joy-Con controllers to shoot you know what as well, though? diving headers. If it's online play as well, like, I can imagine playing with friends. By attaching a Joy-Con controller to the Oh my god, I'm gonna totally kick the TV. The, <laughs> the, game, <laughs> the TV's dead. Mode with intuitive kicking motions. Badminton. Control your shots left and right while keeping the shuttlecock in the air. Unleash powerful smash shots to gain the upper hand. Finally, yeah, no, like this is just like essential type of an essential type of game. This is the game that you have on your shelf for like when people come over as well. I feel like volleyball is the greatest sport in the world. I'm gonna play this all day now. This is not no longer just the game I have on the shelf. The game supports local play with family and friends on one Nintendo Switch system, as well as online play across all sports. Nice, nice. Play against survival bowling or opt for random matchmaking that's really good that's like that's not a bad idea the players you'll face fortnite bowling try taking on this challenge you try how was that since i'm cool. already here i'd like to show you some gameplay of one of the newly added sports volleyball mr takahashi oh hello there everyone I'm Yoshiaki Koizumi. Koizumi. <laughs> wow, Mr. Koizumi. I can see you're ready to play. All right. I'll play some volleyball online. Wait, really? Do we need to Mr. see it? Like, let's be honest. Do we need to see it? Ready? I think I'm okay. I've got plenty of space around me. Okay, well. we need to see it. <laughs> All right. Let's start. Okay, we need to we'll see be it. including some live commentary throughout our match. All right. Oh, we're doing this? Uh, volleyball, a newly added sport. <laughs> okay, we're sports. doing this. <laughs> what can we expect today from the Takahashi Koizumi team? It's Koizumi to serve with Takahashi up front. We begin with Koizumi. Oh, Koizumi freaking How will the absolutely destroys Takahashi. Takahashi makes the block. Get him, Koizumi. Another one's coming. He needs to know who he's messing Koizumi with. Koizumi saves it. A setup in the air. And here comes the spike. You get him. Get him. The other team no. saves it and fights back. Break his ankles, Koizumi. And they score. Takahashi didn't quite get it in time. Oh, right, just well, barely okay. scored. That was really good. That was like on the line. Now the other team serves. Koizumi receives it. Takahashi Come on, Koizumi. And Koizumi spikes. Oh, they're playing spike together. Goes right toward okay. the opponent. <laughs> me, me thinking they're against chance. each other. They get the ball. <laughs> and with the setup from Koizumi, Takahashi scores. Well done, well done. Got a point Still though, break his ankle. <laughs> the way he slid over. Stop our match here. After all, we were in the middle. <laughs> we <of> lost. <laughs> all right, I'll be leaving now. Where'd he go? That was an introduction. Takashi's great, Nintendo but like Switch Koizumi sports. just makes me feel very happy. The game launches April 29th. Yep. Switch We're fans eating. Free update in the summer that allows you to play soccer matches with a Joy-Con controller and the leg strap accessory. You can oh, you can't do it at launch? Shootout mode at launch. In addition, we're also planning a second free update this fall that lets you enjoy. Okay, that's nice. Okay, fine. And it's free. That's nice. And now, a request to everyone: to help ensure that you can all enjoy playing online. We'll be having an online playtest before the game launches to evaluate various technical aspects. When? We'd definitely like to ask for your help with this. February 18 to, to 20. Will be available for players with an active Nintendo Switch online membership on the dates shown on screen. For those of you interested, please visit the official Nintendo website for more details. Thank you. That's all I have for now about Nintendo Switch Sports. I hope you're looking forward to this game. So how long have we got? We like 10 minutes left? Nintendo Switch headlines. Okay, let's go for it. The headlines so far have been really good. It's a really good idea.
I've always wanted to play these games, but like it's always been like I think they're like a hundred euro to get the drum kit as well. The latest Taiko no Tatsujin game is coming to the Nintendo Switch system. Set in Omiko City, the sacred town for Taiko drums, you'll strive to become a Taiko master along with mm -hmm. brand new character Kumokyun. Drum to dozens of bop and beats, including Megalovania, Gurenge, Feel Special, and Racing into the Night. And yeah, that makes sense. All. I always wanted to like the play like version of the main theme from the Legend of Zelda actual video game music. That's 76 songs total. Plus, take advantage of a practice you, like, to replay sections of songs as many times as Because you have like all the Zelda themes in there and like all the Mario themes and stuff. To enjoy. Put on a live concert with up to four players in Donchen Band. Or face off against each other in Great Drum Toy War. I'd fail this right away. I play video games all the time, but I'd fail this. Drum to your heart's content. When Taiko no Tatsujin Rhythm Festival Looks really good. launches on Nintendo Switch this year. Plus, a paid in-game subscription service that gives you access to over 500 songs will be available at launch. Oh. What's new with these Nintendo Switch games? Oh, it's updates. It's updates. Okay, is there gonna be a big announcement tonight? The brand new oh, yeah. tactical RPG game. Yeah. Triangle I'm already. I'm already. I've already pre-ordered this game, so. The protagonist Sarah Noah and his allies will be engulfed in the conflict among three nations. Your choices and conviction will determine their fate. As Lord Triangle Alpha strategy, let's be honest, is way less intimidating than the idea of Octopath Traveler, right? Because it's like three different characters compared to eight, I think it is. End of chapter three will be available on Nintendo eShop later today. Once Save purchased. From the demo can be transferred to the oh, okay, no, no, you can still play purchased. it. More Cuphead action awaits in the paid DLC Cuphead: The Delicious Last Course. That's cool. Here, to still updating it. Explore a brand new Inkwell Isle. Defeat a bevy of new bosses with wild. Yeah, this is a pretty good direct so far. Attacks. The clever Miss Chalice is a new playable character. Cute. Take down Very cute. Foes with her double jumps, rolling Miss dodges, Chalice. and more. Cuphead, the delicious last course, wallops its way onto Nintendo Switch June 30th. Such great designs as well. A free update is coming to the Metroid Dread game. All it takes is one hit. Even from this. Getting hit even once causes a game over in the brutal Dread mode difficulty. This is something I like. People keep asking me to play Can Metroid Dread as well. New challenge? I don't know if I'd enjoy it. And for players new to the Metroid series, take advantage of increased recovery with the newly added Rookie Mode difficulty. This free update launches later today. A second free update in April will add a boss rush mode in which you'll battle bosses cool. continuously Very cool. one at a time. Something's bound for Nintendo Switch. Earthbound. <laughs> it's Earthbound. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my lord. Maybe this is the next let's play. Yeah. I saw someone predicting this. This looks so good. But I already own this game on the Wii U. Like, would, would it make more sense to play it on the Switch, or is the Wii U version just as good? Who am I kidding? I love a good Wii U. But, like, if it's on the Switch, you, might, like, you kind of have to, right? We'll see. We'll see. Like, uh, we'll see if we can definitely let's play this maybe at some point this year. Explore the beginnings, so Earthbound Beginnings. And I understand that it's called Mother in some cases. But the fact of the matter is, is that the majority of people, after this is on this online thing, will probably and will probably call this Earthbound. For the rest of its existence. And that's what it is. It's Earthbound here. You know? Earthbound and Earthbound Beginnings will be added I'd probably to play Nintendo Earthbound Switch for the Earthbound board and Earthbound today. Beginnings. Wow. That's that's kind of nice. Like, it's not a huge, massive, gigantic deal for, but I think for Earthbound fans, it's just an acknowledgement that it's a thing. Right? Well, what is this? Is this a sizzle reel? Is it over? 
Oh no, it's a sizzle reel. Okay. Well, not a sizzle reel, like a montage, I suppose. Can you imagine, like, you're, you're like, hey, I'm in the... We're gonna be in the Nintendo Direct. It's like, where? It's like, the montage in between Earthbound and the final announcement. <laughs> oh, great. That's gonna be awesome. I'm so happy about that. Don't ever dance like that again in front of me. I will actually, I will actually call the police. In fact, I have called the police. What did you think? Here's some news for Mario Kart fans. Many of you have been enjoying the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game since its launch in 2017. Are you serious? So, We've been working on remastering select courses from across the Mario oh. Kart series and we'll so cool, using them as paid downloadable content. Oh, please take a look at I don't, this. I don't know what's, I don't I don't which oh I'm going with here. So I own this game. I bought it at the start of the pandemic. Because I was like, I need a little treat. <laughs> I was one of those people. I need a little treat at the start of this pandemic. And played it for maybe two days or so. It's nice to come back to every once in a while just for a bit of fun, though. The thing is, though, guys, if you're wondering why this game keeps getting updated, it's because it still sells consistently well. Whenever someone buys a Switch, they buy this. They just do. Like, when when a mother buys a Switch. <gasps> Mario Kart Wii? Best, the best Mario Kart game? Coven, it's overrated. Mario Wii is overrated. Okay, and guess what else is overrated? You. By the end of <laughs> you overrated. Such as Coconut, Mall. Coconut Mall. The best course of all time. Chaco Mountain. Chaco Mountain. Never played it. And Tokyo Blur. Will be Tokyo Blur. In the first wave. Not of Coconut course, Mall. You can play these courses locally and online. I mean, this is cool that it's still an update. And again, guys, these, these sell all the time. Whenever someone buys a Switch, they buy Mario Kart. Well, not all the time, but, like, the majority of people do. The first wave of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass will launch March 18th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo Pre Pre-order? This game is getting updated for a while. At no additional cost with the Nintendo Switch Online oh. Plus Expansion Pack membership. Or purchase the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass on its own. Okay. How was that? I hope I thought you were great direct. to the additional courses in Mario Kart That was a pretty great direct. This next segment will be our last announcement. Okay. Please take a look. Thanks so much uh, for the... I thought it was a great direct so far. Fighting in order to live and living to fight. Stop. That's the way Stop. of the world. Stop. Stop it. Ionios. Stop it. Stop it. Stop Tell it. Me, what would possess <laughs> you to side with them? We're fighting because there are enemies to kill. <laughs> you to believe you're here. The accents give it away right away. I saw this coming. You are Stop. not enemies now. This looks so good. Isn't it all that time you've got? You could try, try to move forward again. How can our lives be so snappy little to you? They're not your friends Is this anymore. It? They're his few. Great hair. So much. This looks oh my god. By a great sword. You can't no other game series has this scale. None. It's the only way you're gonna defeat the real enemy. No other game series has a scale. It doesn't. I won't let you soldier it all alone. What good filling up these flickering clocks in our eyes? It will never replace the French people. <laughs> oh, this the is, so this is instantly my most anticipated game. Uroboros abhor this world. They must be erased without a trace. Great character design. This is so exciting! Holy shit. What is it called? 
Is it just Xenoblade 3? Is it just, like... <laughs> oh my god. Yes! Yes! <laughs> oh my god. The story of Xenoblade Chronicles this 3 was fantastic. The futures of the worlds depicted in Xenoblade Chronicles and Xenoblade Chronicles 2, and it will launch this September. September. Forward to it. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Thank you for watching. That's all. You say that's all like it's not a big deal. That is massive. That is mahusive. F yeah.